Alright, so this is the Asus uh, RTS N sixty six U gigabit router, dual band, wireless, N nine thousand, all that stuff. Uh, <clears throat> performance is good. It it reaches upstairs uh, and signal is strong, and that's all that really matters uh, for me. So I'm not going to talk about that, but you know me, so I'm going to talk about the build quality. Um, this this finish here is the same sort of stuff that we've been seeing on some Asus stuff before, like this little slim DVD player. Um, this, this slim DVD player is very light and, and it's fl flimsy plastic, which is pretty expected because it's not really high end, but you see this one has a gloss on it, which makes it look even cheaper in my opinion. Um, this one on the other hand has the same material but it's not gloss, it's uh, sort of a matte finish, which I think looks better. It also has a, a more weighty feel to it. It's plastic, it has vents along the bottom here, which, you know, good for airflow, I guess. Intake airflow. Um, it, it's warm, it runs warm. It has apparently three antennas inside and three on the outside here, which are adjustable ones. Um, it's weighty, I mean, I don't know how, I'd say, may, not necessarily a pound, I don't know how much it weighs, but it's, it's it doesn't feel like, you know, nothing, it feels substantial. These blue LEDs, uh, they're not like some blue LEDs, uh, on case light, on case power buttons and stuff like that. They have a, uh, a f smoked, uh, piece of layer of plastic, a film of plastic over them. So they're very subtle, and they don't they don't want to light up the whole room, and they don't light, you know, they don't hurt your eyes. They're not ridiculous. They're very, very subtle blue LEDs, which is a really nice change to see, finally. Along the top here, hopefully it'll focus. It says uh, Dark Night, uh, double 450 megabits per second. Uh, this is a bit of fake brushed aluminum and you can tell it's fake because if you look along here it's there's no seam it's all one piece continuing on from the uh, plastic stuff and then over to the fake brushed aluminum it's all one piece and there's no seam but it looks I mean it looks real to be honest and it feels pretty real too it has a texture um, this is plastic but it, it feels a little bit better than the um, the DVD drive, and you know it's it feels hollow when you tap it. So it has vents along the side, and uh, none along the front side, and none at the back. So it has vents on both sides and on the bottom. So it's good. I mean, easy easy setup. The Interface for the control panel thing is pretty straightforward. Everything's well laid out along the side. Uh, the build quality, I'd say, is good. I'm pr it's plastic, but it's good plastic. It feels good, and it looks good. I, I you know this is not my favorite thing, but it looks good. So I like it. Uh, you know performs well, and uh, so I'd say it's good.